I believe I told you uh, several times before that I, for the time being at least, uh, turned my back on uh, HF operation due to um, boredom and predictability and concentrate more on VHF, UHF and SHF. These are frequencies for all of you who don't know above 50 megahertz, well actually above 30 megahertz. While I do a fair bit of 6 meter operation, um, for now I concentrate more and more on uh, 2 meters SSB. And um, this is a solid base station. It's vintage. Um, some of you might know it. It's the Kenwood TS711. This is the E model, the European version. There's an A model as well for the American or North American market, uh, which I believe has CTCSS. as I'm not 100% sure about this one. This one only has the uh, 1750 hertz um, tone call for um, old style repeaters. But this is not really meant to do um, be used on repeaters. This is more for um, low signal operation like SSB, CW, and uh, I use it successfully on the amateur radio satellite as well. Um, I quite like the design, it's uh, fairly straightforward, no complicated menus like in so many other more modern transceivers. And it's, it's, it's hefty, it's got a good weight to it. This is the uh, PA here at the bottom. Uh, at the back it's the uh, I think it's 25 watts in SSB which is plenty combine this with a high gain Yagi and uh, and uh, you're good to go really it's all you need or use a group of Yagis I've got two times uh, nine element tonners and uh, it's good enough for me basically I also have a halo loop but uh, more on that later you can also get the uh, sister transceiver or the brother transceiver however you want to phrase it the uh, TS811, um, which is the 70 centimeter model. I haven't got one at the moment, but I'm trying to get one. They look good side by side, and you can combine them and use them on the on the amateur radio satellites. Or just what I do right now is uh, on single sideband, and I also use it as an uh, IF for a 23 centimeter. I bought a 23 centimeter transverter, and this uh, transceiver is ideal. Um, there's not much more to say other than uh, if you get one of these make sure that these keys function properly sometimes they get a bit mushy and you press them once and what you actually what actually happens is you press them multiple times then it's time to um, change the keyboard which is not a big deal in itself but the hard bit is to get a new keyboard for it I have one or two in stock and um, I might list them in the shop later later on other than that, I can't think of anything bad, really. The, uh, the, um, the solid state amplifier here at the back is rock solid. I never had one that failed. Um, the only other thing is the internal DC unit. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention this. Some tools are falling down here. What I forgot to mention is this has a mains input, so you don't need an external power supply. Just plug in the wall. The DC unit behind this um, can fail occasionally but it's uh, so simple you can easily repair it yourself using stock components and if, even if it fails just run it then on 12 volts feed it here through the dummy plug yeah that's it for me two meters is great for now uh, once i get bored with that i switch over to 70 centimeters i suppose and i keep you posted the next transceiver we am going to we are going to review is uh well hopefully the 811 if i can get hold of one I um, put some feelers out uh, towards Japan and there is an OM who might sell one. The problem is the postage. If he finds the original box, he can ship it easily. If if not, he does, just doesn't want to pack it into any other uh, box. And that's only only fair. Um, yeah. Oh, by the way, if, you, if you're into lineups, get the uh, TS440 uh, from Kenwood, which looks very similar and they look good side by side. All right, that's it for me, definitely. Thanks for watching again, and please do me a, f a personal favor. Head on down, click the subscribe button and the little bell so you get notified whenever I upload one of my videos. Thanks for all two of you who are watching, and I'll see you next time around. See you on the bands. Bye.